Hi, I'm Paul Rodelavich from Synergy Electrical Sales. Today we're going to show you RGBW lighting. One of the coolest parts of the LED revolution is creating unbelievable colors in commercial applications. We're going to show you the basics of DMX wiring and then finally how you can use a Lutron dimming system to easily create color combinations in a commercial application. Okay, so here's equipment we need to make great color changing lighting. We're going to show you from Ion LED and We've got our four colors, red, green, blue, and white. All right, so here's the basics of how it's done. We've got their LED driver. And what this driver does is it actually has four outputs coming through this wire out to our LEDs to make our different colors. It has unswitched line voltage coming in right here. Okay, and then the way that we're able to do those different colors is right here with our DMX 512 wiring. So DMX has a common wire plus two wires twisted and shielded. So there's 512 zones that we can assign intensities to. So in this case, we're just using four. So uh, DMX zone one is red, zone two is green, zone three is blue, and zone four is white. So that's how we're doing that as well. So if we needed more colors, and more addresses, we could do that as well. And then we also mentioned bringing into the Lutron equipment. So we need something to tell this driver what colors we need at what intensities. And that's coming out of this unit. So this is our DMX output. And then up here, we have our control wiring from our Lutron system. Okay, so now we have um, the LED lighting hookup to our graphic eye, and we can show you how you can make some cool color combinations. More importantly, get them to be saved and accessed easily um, for your application. So what I'm going to show you is again we've got our Lutron Graphic Eye. We have labels over here which are, are really nice as well. So I've got red on, so if I go over to this zone, I have red. So what I want to do is just show you how I can make um, just a nice pink color that we want to remember in our preset. So I'm going to add some green. Keep going, add a little bit of blue, a little bit more. And you can see, now we've got that in those channels. And again, what the graphic eye is really good at is saving scenes. So I have that preset as well. You can watch another video about how to set the scenes. There we go. Thanks for watching.